In this video, I will show you how to run a simple Java class using NetBeans without creating a project. So this is the Java class. It does not belong to any project. And I want to run it using NetBeans. So let's go to NetBeans and I need to open it. So let's go to file and then let's click on open file. Now it is on the desktop and this is it. So I have to select it. Then let's click on open. Now this is the Java class. I have just to run it. So I have to make a right click, then run file. And this is the output. So let's close this window and let's close this file. Now it is possible to create a new Java project using NetBeans and to add the class into this project. So let's go to file. Let's create a new project. And here I will create a project with int because this is the easiest way to create a Java project. Now let's select Java application and let's click on next. So let's call this project welcome project. So here I don't like to create any Java class inside this project because I have already a Java class that I want to include. That's why this checkbox should be unchecked. Now let's click on finish. Now let's go to the Java class. Let's make a copy of this. So let's copy it. Now let's go back to NetBeans and here on the source package, I have to make a right click, then paste. Now let's expand this node and this package. And here we can find the Java class. So I can just modify the title to check that I am executing the right class. So let's type two. Let's save this class and let's run it. So run file. And this is the output. The title is well modified as expected. So let's close it. So it is also possible to run this class by making a right click here, then run file. And this is always the output. A third way to run this class is to click on this button. So let's click. And here, as it is mentioned, I don't have a default class, but the possible classes that can be the default classes is this one, welcome frame. So let's select it and let's click on OK. Now this class has been executed and this is the output. Finally, thank you very much for watching and please subscribe to the channel.